What's up, my loves? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Maya, if this is your very first time here. So today, y'all, we are going to be doing this five minute makeup tutorial. We are timing it today. <laughs> we might've went over just, just a smidge past the five minutes, but you know, it still turned out beautiful. <laughs> I am about to run out and do some errands and I just felt like I wanted to show you guys my updated like real quick and easy makeup tutorial, what I do to get up out the dough when I just ain't got the time for the full beat. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that you will need to create this face and then we gonna hop into the time tutorial. Before we hop into the tutorial, please make sure that you hit subscribe below if you have not yet so that you are updated when new videos come out. Also make sure you hit that notification bell as well so that you are updated when new videos go up. All right y'all, let's hop right into this five minute beat. All right babe, so this video is not gonna be long at all. Not at all. But before we hop into the time tutorial, I do wanna just show you guys everything that I use or everything that you would need for this quick five minute face. I'm gonna be using my eyebrow gel, which is from Ofra. And if you use a gel, you wanna make sure that you're using something that's really, really sharp, easy to use, not gonna give you a whole lot of problems. It might take a little practice, but you can do it. We gotta make sure we have our primer, and this is the one that I'm using today, which is an Urban Decay All Nighter Primer. And then we're gonna go into concealer. So you need a good concealer as well as a powder to set. I'm gonna be using my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I am a lashes girl, so I got my lashes. These are my Ardell 950s, as well as my duo glue. I'm gonna be using a powder foundation today because we need to cut down on the blending time. So I'm gonna be using my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte Powder Foundation and this is in 410. You guys know I love to tell you to go with compacts if you're like a beginner to go with blush, highlight, and contour. So you could do that. I do have this one from the Lip Bar which is a stunting Minute Finish Face Palette. I am actually gonna use three different products. So I have my Minted Yacht Life Bronzer. I have my Il Maquillage Material Girl Baked Highlighter and I am gonna be using this bling bling blush from the lip bar palette because even though on camera you can't tell but it is more of an orangey blush tone and I love that for darker skin after that y'all all you need if you got a little time is a little mascara if you didn't already do your mascara in the lash area and a good solid gloss and a spray if you want to spray this will go really really fast y'all we're gonna time it we're gonna turn on a timer so not me sitting here waiting for the last 30 minutes for them to stop cutting my grass. They picked the wrong day. All right, so now we're gonna get started. <laughs> we are going to be starting with the brows. So let's do it. <laughs> so the first thing that I will make sure that I do with my brows is create a line at the bottom. Cause y'all know I do, or I have been liking more of a fluffier brow, but I still like my brows to look nicely fluffy you know as well so I feel like this brow wow are they really gonna just start back while I'm doing my makeup okay that's annoying but you know it's fine hopefully it's not too too loud I might have to film this over if it is but we don't see but you guys can pretty much see what it is that I'm doing with my brows this usually will take me about a minute to do um, because my brows are very, very important to me. So I wanna make sure they are good. Okay, I'm literally about to pause this. And we're paused and we're waiting. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, we're resuming. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and with my primer, which is my Urban Decay All Nighter Primer. Put it everywhere around the face. And then after that, I'm gonna go into concealer. This is my NARS concealer. Y'all, they cannot be serious right now. This is so annoying. I do put this on my nose, down my nose, kind of in the places where I want to highlight and that's really pretty much it. And I'm gonna blend it out with my sponge. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take some powder. I'm gonna dip into the powder with this kind of a flat brush and just set that because I always need to set like my under eye wherever I go in with lighter concealer. For me, it has to be set. So that's perfect. And I'm also gonna take a little bit of the concealer and sculpt my brows just a, just a smidge, girl, because I... 
<laughs> like I said, I like a more, um, a brow that's very sculpted out. So I need sis, I need. Before I hop into my foundation, I'm gonna go ahead and put my glue on my lashes. If this, if anything takes us over the time, it will be this because um, I'm not a mascara person. So <laughs> I feel like if you are a mascara person, you might wanna wait all the way until the end, but I'm not. I do do lashes and it gives me life. So um, yeah, got my glue on going into this foundation and I am using a brush because I feel like um, going into this foundation, you want to use a brush because you can control more of what you're putting on. You can really control the layers and how much coverage you have. And I also feel like it's way easier to blend out too when you're using a powder foundation. I would definitely have to say it's a lot, a whole lot easier. So now I'm going to go into some bronzer using my minted bronzer. And I'm going to add just a little bit more color to the face, warmth to the face, all the way around the face. Oh girl, I should have got my hair out of the way. Sometimes I will go with this on top of my eyes just to add a little bit more intensity. Well, not intensity, but just make my eyes look less... Um, naked you know <laughs> and then from there y'all we are ready for some blush i'm gonna hit it with a little bit of this blush and we're definitely gonna go over like by a few seconds maybe a minute this might be more like six minutes but i'm adding a little bit of blush then i'm gonna go into my highlighter just to add a smidge of highlighter on my nose on my lip right here, as well as on my cheekbones. I'm gonna add some gloss. This is my Ashley Strong by Morphe gloss. And it's a good like tone. I feel like it's like perfect for my you know, my complexion, to me, it just looks very much like it is um, my skin tone. And I'm popping on my lashes and we got four seconds, y'all, and we're pretty much done. <laughs> I hear you, Alarm. I know you done. <laughs> and I think I'm gonna go ahead and add just a smidge of some bronzer around my nose. Y'all know I love to do that, but we are still kind of within a six minute period here. <laughs> if you're not a lashes person, you probably have time from just putting on mascara, you know, to do some bottom mascara. Like for me, that's the last thing that I probably would do. But then I'm gonna spray my face. All right, y'all, that's it. I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can see how our skin and what we are looking like. Yeah, I just feel like this is like the perfect like go-to makeup. The skin looks good. You know, everything is covered. You know, it's not given too, too much, but it's just given just enough. It definitely looks like, you know, you got up, you got yourself together, but little did I know it just took a quick little minute. <laughs> I do feel like maybe with a little bit more experience, you can get it down to like the five, six minute range where I was, but I feel like anybody can do this in about 10 minutes, especially if you are not like a false lash person, if you just have mascara girl because I feel like that's what took us over the edge that's what took us over the edge <laughs> I just feel like it's doable you know I feel like you just need to sit down and really get into your stuff figure out your main products that look the best on your face your complexion and just practice make sure that you get it down and that way on the days where you got 15 minutes and you trying to get up out the dough you can do it <laughs> <laughs> I hope you babes really enjoyed today's video. If you did, please make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Comment below, let me know what you thought. Also, make sure you hit subscribe below if you have not yet. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.